Hello, in this video, I am going to show you the void operator. So the void operator, you know, you attach it to some sort of function and it returns, you know, undefined. Am I wondering why would you want it to return undefined? Sometimes you require that result. So if you want to, you know, perform some code and you need to have a return of undefined void is the great it is the route to go. Okay, so let's create a little, what should we do, what should we do? Yeah, let's just create a quick h1, so on click, we'll say, we'll call this void func, void the reserved keyword, so we can't use that, so we'll call it void func, we need to go to capital V, and we'll call this void and here we'll put so what you do you do void then function then your function name so it's void func open close bracket curly braces just one thing because this is like an operator method you have to have another set of opening closing brackets and a semicolon here you could put it all on one line but just a little i think better like this so let's see what happens. So if I do a console.log, like so, and we do, 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 do. You know what, I'm not gonna do it on click. I'm not gonna do it on click at all. So I'm actually gonna remove that. I'm going to take this, I'll just take it to this file and i'm actually going to manually call the function myself so i'm going to say void func the console log i'm going to say hi so reload says hi but then it says uncaught reference error void func is not defined so even though void func is actually defined here because we put the keyword so if i actually get rid of that Oh yeah, it's, it's this extra little bit here that's messing it up. There we go. So if you know you want to be able to run some piece of code, but then you need a a response that says it's undefined, you know you may need that. But for some sort of error check in using some sort of try catch block, then the void operator is the way to go. That's it for this video. If you have any questions, feel free to pop me a message, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.